this is Reese. Here's my current work in progress. I've had a few people ask questions lately about air dry paints and a lot of them are concerned that if you make a mistake you can't fix it without stripping the doll right back to the beginning. So I thought I would make a few mistakes on purpose to show people that you can actually correct it without stripping him right back. Um, right here on the tummy plate I left a dot of paint that's been there for about two days and then when I was mottling I left some of it unblended so I ended up with a paint line so what I would normally do is use non-acetone nail polish remover because that's normally what I have in the cupboard but it's not always the best option because it can be a bit dangerous if you don't know how to do it so what I'm using today is some rubbing alcohol this is really really good to get paint off so you'll need some rubbing alcohol and some q-tips. I've put some, just a little bit of rubbing alcohol in the bottom of a ramekin. And I'm going to dip my q-tip in. You don't want it soaking wet, so you'll have to squeeze it out. You just want it damp. Okay. So now I'll go onto the paint dot that I left and you just want to dab at it. Don't rub vigorously. Um, if you rub you can end up taking off more than the layer you intend to take. So just keep dabbing away patiently. It can take a little while. But as you can see, it's going, and it's gone, and you haven't taken away any of the other paint, it's just that top layer. And really, you do the same thing for the watermarks as well. I can hold my camera. So these ones here are the ones I'm not happy with. So I'll just dab at them. I don't want to make these completely go I just want to fade them a little bit so I'm not going to dab as much as I did on the on the paint dot So that little bit is blended and I'll just keep going until I'm happy completely but that in a nutshell is how you do it um, you can't take off whole layers of paint this way I suppose you could if you were really patient and you used a cotton bud cotton ball um, but generally if I want to take off a whole layer I just strip the baby back because I'm a little bit too impatient when it comes to doing that. With the nails, I think I want to take them all off. So, I'm 
So you can see they're really not a very nice colour. Um, so I'll just do the same thing. I'll do it with the rubbing alcohol still. And, but this time I'll rub it and it'll come off a bit quicker. You can use a toothpick to get in around the edges. And there you go. See, it's quite easy. I'll go around the edge of that nail with a toothpick, but I don't have one handy, so I'll do that later. But it gives you an idea of how you can fix your baby up if you use the air dry paints without going to the drastic measures of stripping them. Hope this was a little bit helpful. And thanks for watching.